Hi, I'm Aki, a minimalist who is a school teacher living in a small village in Japan. One of the greatest things about being a minimalist and not having many things is that it doesn't take a long time and isn't a hassle when I have to move. Actually, I'm moving today, so I'd like to share my experience with you all. Please take a look at how I can move all my belongings by myself in a short amount of time. I'm moving to a different room on the second floor in the same share house. Well then, let's get started! The first step is to put the small things in the cardboard box. By doing this, you can carry a lot of things at once. As you can see, it'll take me a little longer than usual because I'm doing it while filming and moving the camera around. I'm taking out the monitor. All the cards are placed in the box below the monitor because it looks so organized and is easy to carry together. Packing all the small items was completed in 8 minutes. Because I don't possess many things, this task was finished very quickly. Now let's carry things to the new room. The first thing to carry up is my bedding. I don't sleep in the normal bed, so luckily I don't have to carry such a heavy and bulky item. I just have a simple folding mattress and a sleeping bag. I carry the mattress and a sleeping bag like this. It's as easy as holding a big baby. Next is a bamboo bike. It's a little difficult to carry the bike up the stairs because it's so narrow. Next are my clothes. All my clothes are hang all together in the closet, so you can carry it all at once like this. You're able to hang it on the clothing rack at once. I did it! So far, it's been 15 minutes. Next, I will carry up the cardboard box. And here, an incident occurred in which the camera fell while I was moving everything. That sucked, but time to move on and carry my monitor and ukulele next. All that's left are these miscellaneous things. First, I bring up my camping equipment and yoga equipment. I carry as many things as I can. Now, 20 minutes have passed. I wanted to finish everything within 30 minutes, so I need to be swift like a ninja. I carry the box containing books, medicine, and some exercise equipment. Actually, it's annoying because I have to adjust my camera every time. This is a kimono storage bag, cushion, hanging bar, and a box to store my mattress. And finally, I'll carry the green sheet that I use for shooting, some cleaning tools, and tatami mats. And now, it's finally over. The final time was 26 minutes. I started at 12.06 and I finished at 12.32. I was able to move my luggage to a new room in the amount of time it would've taken to watch one anime episode. Of course, after this, I cleaned my room thoroughly. When I move to a new room or home, I always try to make it more beautiful than when I first came. First, I do a quick dusting of the floors. After that, I wipe everything down with a cloth and clean every corner. Finally, I finish wiping the floors with a wet towel and I'm done. Dust can easily collect on the shelves, edges, and window ledge, so I clean them thoroughly. Let's move on to the bathroom. I don't use chemical-based cleaning supplies to wash the tub. Recently, I've been washing it with alkaline electrolyzed water. Alkaline water removes dirt and bacteria. Because it's basically water and doesn't include harsh chemicals, it's good for the earth too. I also use this on the toilet and wipe it quickly with a small amount of toilet paper. Whenever I clean, I basically use my bare hands. Some people may think it's gross, but I don't care. Rather, my heart feels fulfilled after cleaning this way because I used my bare hands and I felt everything becoming cleaner. For these sticky stains, I used this white cube called a melanin sponge. Melanin sponge is convenient because all you need to do is soak it in water 
and begin wiping everything. Therefore, I don't need to use detergent. Oh yes, now I'm officially moved into my new room. What do you think? The old room was full of luggage and now has become refreshed. I'm so happy about it. Now I will continue to organize and create a space that I love in the future. Finally, it's time to relax the mind and body. Thank you for watching as usual. I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye.